local government to make a difference. Isn't that right? Isn't that the... I mean, it can't be the glamour. <laughs> or the prestige, or the perks, or... It can't be any of that. It could only be to make a difference. So let's assume that that's why we got into this. That's why anyone that you're ever going to deal with, that's how they started. It was to make a difference. You're talking about change. Let's say they've got two perspectives. They could have an open mind or a closed mind. They could believe whatever you're saying, or they could fold their arms and go, yeah, I've heard this before, I'm not buying this again. Do you recognise that choice that we make? I'm open believing or I'm rejecting. I'm up here telling you it could be great. I've got two choices too. I could be lying or I could be telling you the truth. I'm giving you a genuine opportunity for transformation, or it could be just rebadging and renaming the same old stuff. Do you ever see that happen? Quite often we're presented with phony change. It's the same old stuff just dressed up with a new three-letter acronym. Yeah? But what would happen if real change came along? Is it possible that we could reject it because it looked like the phony stuff? So here's the choices that are made. What would happen if your mind was open and I said, here is change, but it wasn't the genuine article? What's the outcome for you? You got your hopes up one more time and they got dashed one more time. Do you recognize that? But there's that classic disappointment where I believed it was going to happen. This time I thought it was going to happen and it didn't. Oh well. Do you recognize this? We get our hopes up and then they get dashed. In fact, we should be getting pretty good at this because this has happened a lot. What would happen though if what I'm doing is giving you an, an empty rebadging of the same old stuff and you don't believe me? You keep your mind closed. What do you get to say? Told you so. Yep, I can smell this a mile away. It's the same old stuff. But what would happen if you were presented with a genuine opportunity and you decided to close your mind because you've heard too much funny stuff? What's the outcome? The outcome is this. We blow a rare chance for real change. We're like an elephant in an open cage going, yeah, I don't believe this. But what would happen if a genuine opportunity came along and our minds were open? And the minds of our, our people were open? Guess what it means for them? It means a chance to make a real difference. Now, if this is what we're in it for, in the, totally, if this is why you're in local government, who would want to blow the chance? Which means the only sensible thing that your colleagues can do is to take it on faith. It's the only thing that makes sense. Because the worst thing that could happen is they're let down. In fact, here's the choice. Would I blow a rare chance for change for the right to say I told you so? Or would I risk disappointment one more time for the chance to make a real difference? Because ultimately, it comes down to this. When it's all over, when we finally write your report card, what do you want it to say? What's the final outcome of your time in public service? Is it going to be this? I achieved all my performance indicators and complied to all departmental protocols. Is that good enough for anybody in this room? Is it good enough for anybody in local government or anybody at all? How about this? This is a popular one. I kept my head down and asked no questions. Is this anyone's idea of a good time? I don't think so. How about a life devoted to this? I made the boss look good. There goes my bell. I'm just on time too. I preserved the status quo. I think we want more than this. Not just the people in this room, but the people back at the office. What we want, what we really desire, is this. This is what it's all for. If you've got a project, if you've got an idea, and it's a genuine chance to make a difference, the people that you deal with are looking for a way to get involved. I love what you do. Keep doing it. Push harder. God bless you. Thank you.